Hello, welcome to Painting to Delinea Cauliflora using gouache with me, Aisa Domingo, as your workshop facilitator. Thank you, Phil Bass and the Fora Project for having me here. And most of all, thank you to our viewers for spending your time with us. I hope you learn a lot from our session today. Often, this illustration comes to mind when one mentions the name Katmon. But this kind of Katmon is in fact an illustration of the Delinea Filipinensis. But when you search Delinea in Cos Digital Flora of the Philippines or CDFP, it has 13 species all in all. So just in case you're not familiar with CDFP, it is a checklist of the native, naturalized, and that an invasive vascular plant species of the Philippines. So we're going to focus on one of its unique species, the Delinea cauliflora. What makes it unique is that it is cauliflorus, meaning it produces flowers from the main stem or older branches. So this is what it looks like. It has the same kind of flowers, but it grows from the tree trunk. The Delinea cauliflora is endemic to the Philippines. It is found in Leyte, Mindanao, and Samar. It is currently listed as vulnerable by the DENR. So here are the photos up close, courtesy of our friend Michael Galindon. Thank you, Mike, for sharing your photos with us. So let's get familiar with the parts, shall we? So we have our flowers, our flower buds, the moss in the tree trunk, and then we have the stigma, which is the asterisk or star-like shape, the reddish orange center is called the central stamen, and the yellow orange that surrounds it is the peripheral stamen. So let's get started. So we're going to need a pencil, an eraser, a 4 by 6 watercolor paper or board, gouache paint in red, yellow, green, brown, black, and white, assorted brushes such as flat, round, and brushes for detailing, palette to mix your colors with, water, rag or tissue, and your reference photos. Now we go to the exciting part. 